I was going to grab them last Friday, and I decided I'd put them new shoes on. Okay. New diabetic shoes? Yeah. Okay. I had them on for half a day. Okay. And I had to go back to the... Well, that's all. I mean, a new shoe, you shouldn't be able to wear it. I mean, you need to break it in. Well, I, it's been a year now that I've tried to break it in. Oh, so it's not a new pair? No, you got it last... I got it from you last August. Okay. And I've been trying. That's what I think caused my thing. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. I'm no doctor. This is this is your psoriasis. So this is not a cal. This is not a typical callus. It's a. Uh, see how it all just kind of peels off here. Mm -hmm. That's the psoriasis. So this, this shoe didn't cause this. Um, then I'm, I'm, what I'm thinking is that uh, if those diabetic shoes are not working, then we need to do a different pair, but it's been almost a year, so it's not like we can send them back or anything. Yeah, but doesn't you get every August, don't I get a new pair? You do. So, so we ain't got far to go. Right. So I'll have my assistant who do, takes care of all that stuff. She'll come in and talk to you when we're done here. And um, she'll get that going for you. And we'll just pick a different style or a different brand. Yeah, I thought I'd go with tennis, some kind of tennis shoes. Okay. Something. Yeah, there's lots of different types of shoes that qualify as diabetic shoes. That Medicare will. Cover. Cut all that off. She ain't gonna be able to take no pictures. Oh, she's already taking pictures. Who is that right? Yeah. You're good. So I'm gonna just take off some of the thick stuff and then we'll kind of sand everything down here a little bit. Um, I don't know if you can see this side where you are. Mm -hmm. So this is like less than half of what you had when I saw you last time. Mm -hmm. This looks actually really great. My wife says that she thought it was looking a lot better. Yeah. But if I don't put that ammonium stuff on every, every you know, twice a day, right. they start itching. Okay. Well, at least we know that you have something you can use that helps. Yeah. That won't... Um, burn like the urea cream did. You're, um, you must have thought I was going to use it for a long time. Got you a huge bottle. You got me two bottles. Okay. And you've got 98 prescriptions left on it. Well, when I put, you know, I can't say as many as you need on the electronic. Mm -hmm. It requires a number. So if you put 98, that just kind of tells the pharmacist whenever you need the refill, give you the refill. It's good for a year. So that's just kind of how it's like code.
callus down on either side of that crack okay. and will definitely help that close. All right, so that looks, you know, I won't say it looks great, but it definitely looks better by 50% from where we started last week or two weeks yeah, ago. Yeah. I, I'm sorry we didn't have the video going then. That was something to see. Okay. All right, so we're good. So I'm going to say I don't need to see you back for the calluses, but you definitely um, keep using that lotion, and then we'll see it again when you come back for your regular routine visit. Yeah. And then I can have Cassie come in and talk to you about your diabetic shoes. Yeah. And um, there was it, something about it. It yeah. just didn't fit you right. No, there's something about them shoes I have to come, not when you're on a visit, is that correct? Right, we can't get you your diabetic shoes on the same visit where we trim your toenails or Medicare won't pay for them. I don't understand the wisdom of that, but that's their rule. So, but I'll have her come talk to you about okay. it, okay?